Hey guys, Nightwing for 50 here. I got the cookbook, as promised. Uh, if you guys didn't see last episode, you wouldn't understand why that made any sense. But I have a cookbook now next to me. I'm also opening a can. Because I'm thirsty. So what, what have you been doing, Monster Puppy, while I was away? Well, I was mining. Duh. Alright, let's, let's pop open this book. Alright, Jesus, a big book. I mean, how many pages? Obviously. Yeah, I don't know how many pages it has. Um, peanut butter cookies. Oh, hey, isn't that what you wanted to do? Peanut butter bread. Uh, two, two one fourth cups of unbleached all purpose flour. That's flour. One and a half tablespoons of baking soda. Baking soda, yeah. <laughs> One and a half tablespoon of fine salt, sea salt. I don't have sea salt, pretty sure. I think you can supplement that with most other types of salt. One cup. Yeah, <laughs> one cup of firmly packaged light brown sugar. I don't have mean, that. I don't have brown light sugar. Half a cup of gra granulated sugar. Granulated sugar is just white sugar. Oh, okay. Because I was going to say I don't have that, but if it's regular sugar, I do have that. One cup of unsalted butter. I have that. And if you don't have unsalted butter, it resolves to page 333. You can just salt your own butter. Mm -hmm. And a cup of creamy peanut butter, which you can also make in this book. Two large eggs, one tablespoon of pure vanilla extract. I don't have vanilla extract. I have that. Uh, and that's it. And turbinated sugar to coat. What is turbinated sugar? Turbinated sugar or powdered sugar? Turbinated. No, turbinado. Huh. So apparently this would take around 15 minutes uh, to prep it and then 12 to 14 minutes to cook it. Yeah. So yeah, that's one recipe, I guess. Throw ingredients. Simple recipe. Simple recipe. What, is, what else is in here? Mom's chicken noodle soup. Do you ha do you want like what do you want to cook? You find it. Ooh, pretzel sticks. How many pretzel sticks? Two cups of filtered water heated to about 100 Fahrenheit. You have, you have water, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, half a cup of firmly packed light brown sugar. You have instantly dry yeast. I don't think I have instant dry yeast. Mm. Then we can't do this one. A fourth of natural tasting oil. What? I think you can just use any sort of oil. Na but with natural tasting oil. What does that even mean? Naturally tasting oil. That doesn't not answer like, my question. Not repeating like what I said. Not like flavored oils. Not some sort of like fancy flavored oil. Right. Okay. Uh, five and a half cups of unbleached all-purpose flour plus more for dusting. Okay. And fine sea salt, flaky sea salt. We could probably do that. Oh, you're gonna make pancakes? Okay, I, I'll be honest. If I just come over to make pancakes, that's a sad life. Because I can make waffles. But these pancakes probably taste delicious. Because, see, like, pancakes is very easy to make. Yeah, you just need a pancake mix. Yeah. I but think this... this is just like you make your own mix instead of just buying Yeah, it and, and that's why I like it, because it sounds more professional. It probably tastes better. Okay, one and a half cups of unbleached all-purpose flour, two tablespoons of baking powder, a fourth of, of teaspoon of baking soda, two tablespoons of granulated <laughs> sugar, two tablespoons of fine sea salt, zest for one lemon? Zest is the shavings of the orange. You, you just shave the orange peel, basically. That, how, what, how, okay. You, you basically <laughs> take a grater and you grate the orange peel, or the peel. Zest. I didn't. I don't. See, like I would not remember that. Nor do I really want to remember that. 
Okay. I'm also looking for any shinies while I'm doing this. Is there a shiny? Do you see a shiny on your screen? No, I'm busy turning on the volume because I can't hear you for the music. <laughs> <laughs> I turned off my music so I play my own music. Right, where was I? At a two, decent volume? Two large eggs. One cup of whole milk. Okay. That's, one tablespoon of natural tasting oil. Can I think just, the oil bit you can just use any type of baking oils. Can you? Because like I've, that's why I'm always worried. Because if I had to follow this recipe, I'd definitely go out and buy this oil. No, right. for most recipes, they they say like you. Most recipes you can generally use like general baking oils. Ah, okay. So any, like any oil, okay. Because oh. I because I remember reading online vegetable oil and olive oil are like two separate things. Um, they're separate things, but I think for baking, they tend to serve the same purpose. Mm -hmm. They usually serve to bind uh, powdered ingredients together. Mm -hmm. ah. So you're telling me is we can make pancakes at your place? Yeah. Sweet. Okay. One cup of ricotta? Oh, it's like when you're baking. Yeah. Wait. What is ricotta? Ricotta is a type of cheese. Why would you put it in a cup then? Because it's a shredded type of cheese. <gasps> ah. And then unsalted butter. Or cooking spray. I was actually thinking of buying a cooking spray. We have cooking spray. Wait, uh. Cooking spray? Like pan spray? Or... Yeah, cooking spray for greasing. Yeah, we have that. Alright, so that's gonna be enough reading for me for today. I'm glad I pulled this book out of my shelf. But yeah, I, I was thinking of buying a spray because I, I was gonna like make a cupcakes. I did make a cake. I quote made unquote a cake made before. a cake. You helped? <clears throat> cake mix. Ah. Yeah. I made brownies via mix. Because I feel like the the branding like that, where it's like, oh, here's the powder, just follow instructions. Like, I like that. Yeah. Simple. It makes me feel like I actually know how to cook. In reality, I don't, and I'm just hey. really bad. Oh, it's nighttime. What am I doing? Well, it's nighttime, so I guess the reading continues. Uh, do you... Is there pizza in here? I actually don't know. You have an oven, right, that can cook pizza? Yeah. Do you? Yeah, it's a general oven. No, but for cooking pizza. Most ovens can do that. Okay. You can make we can make our own things. You want to make your own mozzarella? Oh. You want to make your simple jams? Hot sauce? Oh, we can make ourselves our own ketchup. You wanna learn how to make ketchup? Professionally? Yeah, ketchup, you just oil tomatoes. Do you? Let me see. Let's see what a professional You ketchup. boil and sweeten tomatoes. Is that not it? Let's see. Ketchup. Okay. Alright. Uh, one can of tomato pasta. Half a cup of light corn syrup. One fourth of white distilled, distilled vinegar. Vinegar. A fourth of sherry vinegar. See, like, there's two different vinegars here. One fourth of sherry, filtered water. Uh, vinegar is just spoiled alcohol. Mm -hmm. So I think the sherry is from a specific type of alcohol. I think sherry is a type of wine. And distilled vinegar is just a generic vinegar. Mm -hmm. Oh, what was it? Filtered water, one uh, fourth a cup of filtered water. Two tablespoons of garlic powder. A tablespoon of onion powder. And one tablespoon of kosher salt. I have all the powders. I have garlic and onion powder. So we can make ketchup. Though, again, this sounds like so much. Like, this is, again, I would just buy my own ketchup. But, like... <laughs> The idea that you could just 
to use your own ketchup is crazy. Or make your own ketchup. Also, is that a shiny? Don't tell me it's pink. Tell me Probably it's pink. It's red. Unless that's how the Pokemon's supposed to look like. A Rhea Dolls. Oh, that is how he's supposed to look like. Wait, who? I'm catching him. Who? A Rhea Dolls. Ariados? There it is, yeah. Ariados isn't red? He is red. No, it's green. No, it's red. I'm looking at him. No. And, it, and the Pokemon's entry also says red. You mean purple? Red. I caught him. Sweet. Wait, no, Ariados is red. Spinarak is green. It's Spinarak, yeah. Which I thought odd. that was a shiny, because I'm like, oh, spin like I because I see Spinarak is green. So I was like, oh, red is the opposite of green, maybe. I don't know. But Dang. no. This is his evolution. Also, there is going to be instances where uh, in the video you guys will see a shiny and I won't. Because again, I don't know Pokemon, nor do I know their shiny evolutions. Forms. Yeah. So if I see, if you guys see a shiny and I don't, well, just know that you play too much Pokemon, you need help. And I play. I don't cool think mode. that's the outtake. Nah, 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 I'm pretty sure it is. It, nah, 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 it, it, it is. It is. It is. Trust me, I'm the YouTuber. Um, I have to get rid of that Pokemon on my Pokebox. Uh, okay. Let's continue reading. I'm like reading a page or two before getting distracted in the game. Just play the game. No. I want to learn more stuff about cooking. So it is date time. Oh yeah, wait, pizza. Wait. Does he have pizza? Big boy Mish. Oh, he has his own multi-purpose dough. Whoa. Lady fingers. I feel like this is all fake. None of this actually makes sense. What do you mean? Gr gr like lady fingers? What is that even supposed to mean? Oh, those are their type of tea biscuit. Why? My mom's made um, pastries out of them. Okay. What a potato gnocchi? Gnoche. Gnocchi. It's a type of French or Italian food. Right, yeah, alright. No, nope, French food. Smash potato Gnocchi. bravos, avocado and egg toast. I mean, I can tell it requires an avocado and an egg. <laughs> and toast. Hey, Ferret, you're here to listen to my reading? I'm very happy about that. Uh, fish, meat, pasta, and sandwiches. Ooh, does he show you how to make a grilled cheese? He does! Oh boy, I think I could do this you one. You might not like it because it's gonna, probably going to be a relatively fancy grilled cheese. You're right. I don't, I'm not. It's too fancy You don't like my fancy table. foods. Two tablespoons of whole grain mustard. Uh oh. Oh no. For the grilled cheese? Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah, it's, I don't ta think... it's tablespoons, so maybe. Two slices of country-style bread or basic sourdough bread. Ooh, sourdough. I like sourdough. Well, he has a recipe on that for page 54. Two slices sourdough. of Monterey Jack cheese. Monterey. I don't, I don't buy that one. I buy the what? American cheese. I'm pretty sure, anyways. Um... Two slices of smoked Gouda cheese? Gouda. Yeah, no, immediately there's two cheeses, I don't know. Two <laughs> tablespoons yeah. of salted butter. Why would you add butter? So you can, you know, toast it? Oh, whatever. I'm going to page 54 for the sourdough. Let me make sourdough. Oh, I passed it. What is this? Oh, it's sourdough starter. Yeah, because sourdough takes a very long time. You have to, like, basically ferment it. Oh, it's this bread. Oh, I actually wanted to learn how to make this. Like, Sourdough? Make... Yeah, well, you make your own bread. Yeah, a lot of people talk about this bread. Sourdough takes months. Does it? Yes. Okay. Okay, prep time is 24 hours. Cook time is 40 to 50 minutes. Oh, wow. 
Well, then you gotta let it, you know, ferment. Well, let's go to, to sourdough. It, you have to let it to turn sour. So sourdough basically... starter is apparently prep time is five minutes a day for seven days. Yeah. Wow. Interesting. And like the but the longer you keep it going, mm -hmm. like you like add on to it, it like you know basically develops like its own specific flavor. Oh, so you mean if I give you this star a sourdough starter and you keep it alive long enough, we can get really good bread? I guess. Okay. Anyways, going back to the bread, without using the sourdough starter yet, we'll skip that one. 35 grains of whole wheat flour, 35 grams of unbleached all-purpose flour, and 30 grams of filtered water. Room temperature. Nice. What an autolyzer. I have no clue. Autolyze. 804 grams of unbleached flour, 75 grams of whole wheat flour, 740 grams of filtered water, heated to 90 to 95 degrees Fahrenheit, divided, and 18 grams of sea salt. I'm closing this book. I'm done reading because it's about to be daytime. It's sunrise. Wait, I'm missing it. Ah, Mazabari, wait. Uh, I'm uh, busy. I'm reading a book. You should stop me. Books are for nerds, except cookbooks. Cookbooks are for chefs. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, well, something interesting did happen while you were gone. Mm-hmm. Well, so I was trying to jump up onto a thing. Mm-hmm. Like a dum-dum. Oh. I jumped into lava. <laughs> okay. And then, like a dum-dum, I went into the exact same thing. <laughs> Uh, I thought you were gonna say, as a dum dum, you try pour pouring water on yourself, but instead you just poured lava on yourself. No. Why would I do that? <laughs> I, don't. I don't even have water. Do you not carry a bucket of water with you? No. I have a bucket of lava with me, but. Or bu a bu just a bucket. Oh my god, Zangoose. Okay. So basically you're saying that once I'm in with my building, I should go to the ultra wormhole dimension and you find me in XP all? Oh, yep. Because that's how I got mine. It's the best also, way because it's the least explored place. And the, the you pool know what really of items helps? you got is not a lot. Hmm. Uh, if you set the uh, pokey loot, no, of course to, not. You know, everyone can gather it once. No, it's for, for first dibs, as people would say. If you get it, you get it. If you don't, oh well. Oh my god. Do you want a Charmander? You need a Charizard? Is it tiny or really, really big? Uh, normal size. He's normal size. All right, well, it's daytime. It's no longer sunrise or sunset. Why did it take me? I took me, it, I read for almost 90 minutes, quote unquote read, but either way. It's none of 19 minutes. I would not mind giving up again. Uh, I'm heading home to see if there's any shinies near you. Even though I was standing here the entire time. If they are on the ground, I will go ahead and go on the ground and get them from you. I'll gladly take the shinies off your hand. All right, well, there's none, so I'm heading towards the EV place. I mean, at this point, I give up on catching newer Pokemon and just start evolving the Pokemon I have. Which is a good strategy, right? 
I guess. I should probably double check if I have these Pokemon already. Instead of wasting my time evolving it and then realizing I don't need to do it. Alright. No, I don't have you. You're very tiny. I don't have a Dragonite, do I? No, because this is why would I? I don't have the evolution of you, and I'm pretty sure I don't have Click Clang. Pick what? Can't clean Clang. You know, Clink Clang? Yeah. Yeah, I don't have him. Alright, yeah, all the Pokemon I have in my party, I don't have their next evolutions. So what's the Pokeball machine? Uh, no. upstairs. Auto hammer. Auto hammer. What's the recipe for it? Wait, what is it called? What? <coughs> the auto hammer itself. Like, what is the machine called? Is it a furnace? Furnace. Oh, I can just search up what e furnace. Colorful shake. Increase the Pokemon's friendship. How do I make that? What? Oh. I saw I got distracted by a colorful shake, and I'm like, what is that? A mechanical anvil. There you go. Should've just searched up anvil. Furfru. Why are Furfru's so high level? Is this actually a relatively tanky mon? Oh, and it drops white wool. Oh, that's good. So I need some pistons and slime. We have and some iron. Pretty sure we have that stuff. It should be the the two double chests on the left side. Where are the pistons? The crafting bench. They're not against the walls. They're they're away from the walls. Should be on your left, near the crafting tables. Cause I, I put that in end items. I'm pretty sure. Slash mechanical ah, items. Pistons. I don't know if we have slime. We gotta check that in the junk chest. There's three sticky pistons in there. And 22 ball slime balls, so... Yes. I have everything I need. Alright, see? I'm a collector. I collect everything because eventually everything will be useful. Why do you think I crafted a storage system that can hold thousands of different items? In ATM8. Because we have... Because of me! <laughs> Why do you think I have... I kept 32... Uh, 3.2 million Blackstone in my... The one time I played it and then it got all erased. Because I might need 3.2 million Blackstone. <laughs> right, right, right. Well, cobbled... Actually, no. Cobbled Deep Slate. Not Blackstone. 3.2 million. So far in this world... And then 2.4 million... Um... Uh, just regular cobble. I like to say in this world, the only two people who, who have built stuff is me and the third. Dude, I'm literally building under Yeah, but you're the third one now. So it's just us three that build stuff. B2 does not want to, like, simmer down. He just wants to keep going and exploring new and places. stealing our stuff? Kind of. He did steal three of my Master Balls. Maybe four. Three of them? Yeah. I need wood and a bit of redstone. Because <laughs> I don't use Master Balls. Yeah, but why might? One of them was mine. We did give you one. You there... did give me one. I never grabbed it or used it. There is a ball. GS ball? The GS ball, yeah. I'm pretty sure he's the one who Not said. a Master Ball equivalent. Is it not? No. Because he, he brought it up, and I'm like... Kinda has it's used to summon Celebi. But isn't it oh, considered like a 100% catch rate? Nope. It's equivalent to a regular Pokeball. But is it, wasn't there another Pokeball that had a 100% catch rate? I think people might confuse the Cherry Ball 
with it, but no. Cherry ball is a special event ball. Oh, there it is. Park ball. Park ball. Guys, the description says it will never fail. You do know the in like the original games, the master ball wasn't a hundred percent guaranteed. Yeah, I know that. Mm -hmm. I but saw... not like because like yeah, I think I told you about it that one time. I think you're the one who taught me it. Yeah. Because like there was like a slight chance it was like only like ninety nine point nine nine percent effective because there was a slight chance where you just miss completely. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this is why you oh, you set the bar so low that everything you throw is not guaranteed a catch. And that's how I like my video games. Oof. But yeah, well, do you do you know the origins of the park bar? Park ball? I think it was made by Professor Oak. Interesting. If you come back, you you can see my furnace room. Sure. Uh, once it's nighttime. <laughs> so it um, gives you an, it gives you enough time to oh, build more. You did? No, I just need to plant my white apricorns, black apricorns, and red apricorns. Which we probably do have some. Probably some. Some. Yeah. Black. Yeah, white. Some. Red. 26 minutes in, Jesus. I don't feel like. I want to. I mean, we should have been streaming. I'm almost out of revives. Can we craft revives? No, but you can buy them from poker shops. Uh, uh, 1,500 poker each, I think. Because I definitely would rather be crafting them, because that is expensive. Well, I'd... you have, a, like, two and a half st uh, stacks of red apricorns, but they're all cooked. Yeah. Pretty sure we were supposed to make them into regular Pokeballs. But then, oh yeah, yeah, that's exactly what was happening. But the only problem that was holding me back was the iron base. The uh, iron base stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, we didn't have enough iron, and thus uh, we halted. Oh, you production. have like twelve blocks. Yeah, no. Now we now we have blocks. because uh, I'm pretty sure you mine. Someone mined. I, I know that much. Mining. Someone was mining. Uh, as well as I've been killing a lot of Pokemon, anyways, and I was getting little bits of iron here and there. So it was definitely not because of me of those twelve iron blocks. But it was someone else. Unless it was me and now I'm just being dumb. Probably. In, in which case, past me is a different version of me, so someone else did it. A 26? Apricorns are annoying to place. Yep. Because, like, you can't place them inside of you. It's a hitbox collision or whatever. Eevee. I have to sort out Eevees. Keep the, give me the really big or small ones. Yeah, I already... will do. Catch. Ugh. No. Eevee, stay in a Pokeball, please. Because I definitely want to have regular ordinary EVs rather than the huge and small ones. Even though a small one, I would wouldn't mind having because Pokemon EV, that EV is kind of small. Okay, so uh, you're you look massive. How much can I weaken you? Got it. Don't kill it. Don't kill it. 
and kill it. Good boy. Good boy. This song is still relaxing. I would rather have Shapez music over lo-fi music. Have you listened to lo-fi music? No, I don't listen to music. But not not like lo-fi, like the. 20... I don't listen to music. Not not even. Okay. Because I, I for some reason you know Rocket League right? It's all about speed and you know. And they uh, play lo-fi music. They they at one point collaborated with lo-fi, and I don't know who in their right mind. I don't thinks... really know what lo-fi is. It's supposed to be like calming music. Like a type of brand. Is it like, like a type of music or a brand of music? I think it's a type of music because I think lo I've seen lo-fi tag on other like things. Exactly. Because like, I saw gaming right? lo-fi music, so I think it's a type of music rather than a brand. Because yeah, I think that's really confusing. Because I think lo-fi is supposed to represent calm. I might have to pull up Webster's dictionary and see. These kids with their hip stuff, it's crazy. I mean, I have my phone next to me. Ooh, a Pikachu. Am I still going out for your Pikachu? Like a very tiny Pikachu? Nah, I'll do it myself when it's, the time comes. Okay, what was if it's ginormous Pikachu? I don't care, I'll do it myself when the time comes. What, what, like, what happens if he's like really huge? Okay, I, re I found a very tiny Pikachu. I said I'll do it myself when the time comes. He's I got priorities. He's smaller than a block. Okay, then. You want him? I'll get there. Where is you? Say, what do you think I am? I don't see you on the map, though. Ah, I saw you. You were blocked up by... You were being covered by a death marker. <laughs> oh yeah! I, I did drown myself in that pond. I, I did. I do remember an instance like that. Okay, that's a giant milk tank. I will. If you want, I could catch it. Ah. It's gonna be in a pokeball, though. I don't care about that. You don't. But I care. You... <coughs> I care. Oh god. What is that? Oh, uh, this is another Pokemon on top of another Pokemon. There's an Eevee! Panzer Bobby! Give me a second. There's an Eevee! Did that die? Okay, it didn't die. Good, good, good. Eevee, come closer to me so you don't despawn. I'm catching another Flaffy. Uh, milk Tank. A giant milk thing. Actually, it might only be mass. It might not be massive. I'm moving this way, so. Can you evolve Eevee and Pokemon Eevee? You can evolve the other Eevees, but you don't want to evolve your Eevee because I don't think you can because you have a special Eevee. Same yeah. with your Pikachu. I think you told me. It's. It's classified as a different Pikachu. It learns like special, you know, moves that normal P P uh, Pikachus and Eevees can't. Okay, this Pikachu is getting closer to the Eevee. I can't see the Eevee, but it's around here. I can evolve, uh, paralyze a Pikachu, right? <laughs> uh, with the right equipment, yeah. Yeah, with Stun Spore. Okay, you're here, so I'm gonna go for the Eevee. Yeah, look at the mini-map for the Pikachu. He's on the trees. Well, last time I saw him on the trees. Eevee. Eevee. Level 14. Catch combo. Of one. Because I keep fighting everything. Was it in a tree or under the trees? It was on the tree, like on top of the trees. I hear it. Alright, it's less than a block, so it's pretty tiny. Hey, Bulbasaur. Yeah, that too, but like, he's not important. This one? 
Yeah. Well, actually, I don't know. I'm saying yeah, because I'm assuming you're next to that one. There's only one Pikachu nearby. And it's not that small. It was less than a block. That's normal Pikachu size. No, it's not. I'm just going to take down. Okay, let me see. Are you, Because it was right... <laughs> Yeah, it was like right here-ish. Oh, that's you fighting it. Is this how big the other one was? No, this is really small. The other ones I found were ankle size. And I don't remember how my quali qualification or classification of ankle size Yeah, that's is. not that big. Because I don't think that, e that Pikachu is normal. It's it's a normal sized Pikachu. There's no way that's a normal size. I I fought things that were bigger than that. Because you probably found a big Pikachu. Well, I may or may have killed a regular Pikachu then. Oh well, I just killed mine too. You killed it? Yeah. Oh my god. There's no way I don't I would remember if it was that small. There's so many Pokemon here. I like it. Oh no, my Pikachu. As much as I want to op more Pokemon spawning, I'm already <laughs> lagging as it is having you <laughs> standing one place. My game's running fine. Yeah, I know your game is running fine. It's like ATM 8 all over again. <laughs> it's like, yeah. if I'm hosting it and running oh, no. it, yeah. I die. <laughs> Yeah, but you're at least running it. Remember what happened when we tried ATM8 on your computer? It, yeah, no, it kept, You crashed. It keeps freezing. Didn't you, No, you crashed at one point. Like, your Discord cut out. Yeah, no, that's what I'm saying. It froze everything. Yeah. So, that's why I can't run all the mods 8. I am apparently giving up on evolving Pokemon and I'm going for Shiny Eevee now. Alt B. Where did I chuck that? What? This camera! Moved that. And this Moved camera that. could like Moved stop that. whiplashing me everywhere. I mean. Ooh, a massive bunnelby. Like. I need a yeah, heal. I need me a catching mon. Zangoose, uh. Well. Oh. Blade is a really good one. You know why? Hmm. It can do fall. It learns false swipes, mm -hmm. I think. And. It learns hypnosis, and it's pretty powerful. Hypnosis. Is, see, there's a reason why I don't like hypnosis. It's. I mean, its accuracy is low, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So I like sleep powder, but like, if you're going for sleep powder. Sleep powder, it has the same accuracy. Is it really? I feel like it lands more, in my opinion. It's like, ooh, look at the shiny coin versus I just yeeted so Not a much shiny powder. Coin, it's a playing coin. In my eyes, that's what I envision. Right? Hypnosis because of hypno. Hypnosis uses psychic powers. The actual animation in anim in the animes is like a psychic pulse basically. Mm -hmm. Which knocks you out. Uh, hypno and uh, uses the coin because it's hypno. Mm. But everything else does that. No, but when I see like a uh, sleep powder, it's like a giant mist. Right? I need to kill 77 Pokemon. <laughs> that should be easy. Go to Scotland. You want to evolve your or level up stuff. I was going to just do that while going to the. Um... Connie, we. Ultra Dimension. Oh Ultra yeah, dimension. you could be doing that, yeah. Oh, there's another yeah. AV. Good call, good call. And I can also go there to catch Pokemon. Can I... Once I get my Pokeballs up and crafted. I feel like I've caught a decent amount of EVs to have gotten at least one that looks like Team Rocket. You can't tell me I haven't, game. I, like, at least probably caught 50. And it's like 1 in 1,000 something. So, eventually it should happen. 
Do you know what drops blaze rods? Anything in the nether. Ah, perfect. There's all wait, we already have blaze rods. What do you need them for? Fuel. Literally go in my chest near my bed. Because it's better than coal. If you go to my thing, I have uh there's a citizen that is glitched out for me. That will mm -hmm. forever gives give me rods. gives me sixteen blaze rods every time I interact with them. Which thing? Uh chest next to my bed. Take as many as I can then. Take as take as many, they're infinite in my eyes. If you want I can collect them. As long as you keep reminding me I can collect more of them. <laughs> Oh, you haven't, you've yet to check out my furnace room. Yeah, that's, uh, I'll go there once it becomes nighttime. I'm catching Eevees, I'm shiny hunting. Alright, I'm gonna run away from this fight so Eevee replenishes the PP. And it killed itself. Yeah. Uh... Why? Does the catching combo get ruined if it dies after I flee? I don't think so. So it I doesn't. I don't know why it would. It, it's dumb rules. That's all I gotta say. It's just dumb rules. It's, so I hope it doesn't. Well, running away doesn't cancel the thing, so I don't think it. Once you runs run away, I don't think it. You know. Mm. Because running away is how you avoid catching or killing something else. Okay, I'm gonna head home because my Pokemon kind of low on PP. And you can check out my furnace room. It's still daytime. I need to still head out. Well, while you're you know recovering, you're healing. I'm your going mind, to Pokemon can... Center. I'm not going to the house. It's closer. Right. Farfetched. Or far fetched. I was actually going for a far fetched at one time. Uh, the surf far fetched. Well, you need to get surf far fetched to complete the Pokedex, anyways. Oh, you're right. You want to know how to get it? Uh, do I want to give him a leak or something? No, the leak is helpful, but it's not the what actually evolves it. Oh, uh, is it the uh, move? I have to constantly use one move. No, you have to get. Three crits in one battle. Mhm. Mm or is it, you have to get a certain amount of crits in one battle, and the leak boosts its crit rate. So. Oh, uh, because I remember you helped. wanted it too. Oh, I have one. Yeah, that's why I remember. That's why I was saying you need the leak because I remember you were asking for it at one point. I worked hard to get a leak. Okay, it's about to be sunset. My god. It's like daytime, I have to be out in the birch forest. Sunset, I have to be up in the mountains. And then nighttime is when I actually just do nothing. You can check on my furnace room while they're here. And nighttime, yeah. But after that, what do I do? I mean, I can keep reading off the book. But... You can mine iron. Mm. Turn around music. I saw on Reddit today, people were saying, why why didn't they add more achievements? To what? Terraria. They added, like, five achievements in the last update. Did they? Yeah. No, but they want, like, the basic one, which is, like, build the Zenith Sword or whatever. Unless... Is that one not an achievement? I don't remember. I'm trying to remember on top of my head. It probably was that one. There was one where it's, like, lose five platinum coins in one death. Um, there's one where it's like, get a hole in one. Um, yeah. Because, I mean, that kind of makes sense, because obviously no <laughs> one's going to build the golfing thing. And if you are interested in it, it's like, you're going to be Ooh, the minority. It. Yeah. So I kind of like that. Like, I had some achievements like that. Oh, speaking of Terraria, you saw that video I sent you? Which one? The... The speedrun? No. 
I saw yeah. it. I didn't watch it because I don't really care about that. I I feel like we could do it. Though, I don't think so. We're gonna be under so much mental stress. I don't get stressed like that. I you know. You wanna see how that speedrun works? I it... control my emotions. I, <laughs> I feel like I feel like we could do a speedrun of it. Because they cheese the final boss. Actually, no. Doing with you, 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 you can somehow make me angry, which is, you know, challenging. What do you mean? I don't I... get angry easily. You make me angry <laughs> irrationally. Well, that, that's kind of a you issue more than a me issue. Okay, why is there a level seventy-two, um, Doug Trio? In Scotland? Are you in Scotland? No. Just in my house. Oh. Well, what le Y level are you? 14. Yeah. The the lower you are, the higher level they are. I, I know that. <laughs> Zayden, you answered your own question. Ooh, stone. That would not sweet. I don't know what you're saying. You're an apple. You shouldn't be talking. Applin? Uh, wait, actually, speaking of apples, do I even have it? Hey! Apple, yeah, apple evolves into Falapple or Appleton, depending on which item you give it. It's either Sweet Apple or Tart Apple. Doesn't it turn into a dragon type? It is it is a dragon type. It's a dragon grass type, and it stays a dragon grass type. Or it turns into a dragon grass type or a dragon flying My type. Bound Sweep, st Stini, and then Stini. Starina? Tessarina. That's all. Wait, this is all leaf. Wait, that's not the Pokemon I was thinking of. You're thinking Bound Sweet is a Bound Sweet. There's the Bound Sweet, Steeny, and Tessarina is its own line. Because I was thinking of the Dragon Apple. Bound Sweet evolves into Tess uh, Steeny at level 18, and I think uh, once it reaches level 2, it learns just Trop Kick, which allows it to evolve into Tessarina. <laughs> Trop Kick. Drop kick. I love that. It's sunset. It's, it's sunset. like it's a play on tropical kick. No, no, no. A drop kick. Drop. T R O P. T R. -O. You know tropical because it's oh, a leaf, the grass type. It's okay. a grass type kick. I get it. I understand now. Because it's a kick. It's a grass type kicking mod. Yeah, I, I realize now. It's kind of odd how I have some. I've planted some. You know thingies. And like some of them have already sprouting, right? Like I can harvest. Some of them haven't even started growing. Yeah, I don't know. I know. I, it's, it's either I can't. I'm gonna test with whale. Okay, it's not that it's broken. It's just not growing. I tested with a whale mer pal. Yeah, no, that happens for some unknown reason. Some of them just like won't grow until yeah. the rest grow. Yeah, like, or oh, so many of them can grow at a time or something like that. Yeah, something like that. Cause I, I did that with berries, and the berries like either they grow instantly or they just wait a bit. Maybe it's only so many of them can grow simultaneously. Which is a little broken. I need buttons. I uh, my three times. Multiply. I still have my shiny Loron, so maybe we could try and catch a shiny Lucario. If I catch a shiny Lucario, I'm gonna debate if I want it or not. Like, replace my actual Lucario. Wait, wait, I just realized. Does Mega uh, change the shiny? The shinies, the Mega stuff shinies for him, yeah. Ooh. So, the thing is, once you get your shiny Lucario, if you get a shiny Lucario, what yeah. you can do is, if, yeah, um, you can properly EV train it. Because you have one that's just like randomly EV trained from just random leveling. What you can do is you can properly EV train your thing. Right. You know what I mean? Isn't that what the bottle caps are for? The silver that's and gold? IVs. God. I feel like I fell in that trap twice. Yeah, IVs are the... They're... Once you catch a Pokemon, they have preset IVs. 
you can IV tr uh, hyper train them with the bottle caps, which maxes out the gold, maxes out all of them. The uh, silver maxes out like individuals, individual stats on a Pokemon. So gold is better. Yeah, but it's also significantly rarer. I have a couple of them, but okay. You have two of them, and twenty-two silver ones. I saw them in your chest when I took your blaze rods. Yeah, because I have them stored there. Because obviously I. Because they're rare items. But no, um, EV, EVs are trainable as opposed to IVs, and you get different Pokemon drop different IVs. There are certain items you can use to accelerate it, and then there are certain items you use to give or take IVs. Is, there, is it easy to reset EVs? No, because there are certain items... That there are certain berries that raise happiness but decrease certain IVs, so you can do that. Or there's certain, uh, and then there's certain items that give you IVs. So like certain berries, or like there are f certain feathers that give IVs, and then like one IV or EV, and then there are like the protein, the you know the zinc, and those things. Those so give like ten of each IV. You can have a max of five hundred and sixty, I think. And then, but each individual stat can have 255. I don't remember. Okay, 255 plus 255 is 510. Hey, can I just set it to like a uh, max? You can it max out. 520. No, max EVs is 520. But each individual stat can have a max of two, uh, 225. So you can individual max out two um, IVs or EVs and then put 10 into another one. That's how it is. But I don't think Pixelmon has a way to actually like check out EVs or not EVs. Yeah, but I was gonna I say, can I, can I just max the EVs then in the config so like I don't have to worry about that? Uh, that'd be a bit cheaty. I'm pretty sure you're against that. I mean, I, I mean, it's such a stat that has to be such fine art from an expert. It's like I don't know better. I wouldn't mind turning that to infinite, or setting it to everything is two fifty-five. Two fifty-five each. Yeah, cause like I, cause right now I'm just battling things, so I could, cause I, I'm kind of turned on, uh, like, weirded out about that. It's like I don't know what I want with that, cause obviously I don't know better, and I'm just using my Lucario like whatever I want. Also, remember how you were telling me the uh, Pokeverse virus? Pokeverus? Uh, yeah, Pokeverus? Yeah, Bias. no, it doesn't It doesn't get reset when you put it in the PC. No, no, you don't lose it, but it can't spread anymore. No, that's a lie, too. <laughs> that's a lie. What do you mean? <laughs> All the Pokemon I have in my party right now I have it, too. Yeah, but did you keep one Pokemon from your original party? No. No. Everything, everything got put in the PC... Oh, there's an Argentini. Also, it's not a lie because I know what I researched and I know exactly it's not a lie. Because, like, then how do you explain the Pokemon? Maybe I fought another Pokemon that had the Pokerus. Yeah, I... maybe you got another one. Oh, well, Jutini just despawned. Well, that was fun. <laughs> also, I have Pokerus as well. I know your Pokemon? I have it on my Genesect, my Alcremi, my Flappy, my Puchiana, my Sir Farfetch, my Spectrier. Yeah, Gen I think it helps you tr EV train. It like gives you like 2.5 time multiplier on EVs. Oh wait, I'm here for your. Uh, let's go see your thingy. Well, hello there, level 26 dudelet. Storage room. I hear the furnaces. Hello there. I'm putting a chest in here for Pokeball stuff. Iron bases. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> I have two stacks and 42 in my inventory as well. I'm going to go get more blaze rods. I'll be back. I already grabbed all your blaze rods except the individual bits. No, I'm grabbing more blaze rods. AKA, I'm going to go talk to that glitch guy and be like, hey, can I get, ah. can I get the hookup? And he be like, yeah, here you go. I don't remember where he lives, though. Gotta talk to everyone again.
Who here wants to give me free blaze rods? You left the game. Shutting down internal server. Did you crash? I. Why would it di disconnected? Well, don't ever talk to that NPC. Don't ever. T I just talked to someone and that person's like <laughs> shutting down. Like, oh, oh okay. Okay, I'm loading back into the world. Unless that person crashes the game if I ever talk to them, in which case that is evil. Oh no. What? I don't know if I can ever go back into the world. Why? Every time I load back into the world, it just kicks me out. Do you have it backed up? Yes, but it's before we did these two episodes. Which sucks. Ah, uh, ah. Uh, okay, I fixed it. So basically, what has to happen? You you're never, him? you're never leaving this house. Kill him. Lava. <laughs> I'll let you do the killing. Pull him. <laughs> okay, this, okay, this NPC gives me, I, uh, the dragon. You got right. stuck in the house. Uh, Ender Dragon egg. Ah. All right. New numbers are five eight four four two. Five eight four four two. Yeah. So that NPC just crashes my game. I wonder if that actually works on you as well. You want to go talk to him? Uh. Yeah. Some items do it like that. Uh. I had a pipe that did that once, but it would like crash. It wouldn't like kick me out of the server. It crashed Minecraft. You have a bucket of lava with you? No. Because I do want to kill this person. Because uh, <laughs> that almost soft locked me. Literally, I when got I soft locked until what a couple, you know, one point. Yeah, the the only way I was able to get out of the soft lock was to literally hold W or S, like hold the keys to run away from them while moving my mouse. Uh, you crashed again can i not talk to npcs no it's it's not wait wait it's not responding it's not you crashed again i got no, kicked no it's, it's fine never talk to npcs ever again i guess we have to kill all of them no give it a minute dude i got kicked give it a minute it's not responding give it a minute five eight four four two <laughs> Give him a minute. What if I try to join while you're getting kicked out? Oh god, it's white screen. It's white screen. Okay. Connecting to the server. It's okay. Game will come back. Game will come back. Trust me. I can't play music. <laughs> the white music is broken. Hmm. I guess we're ending it tonight. I guess that's it for tonight with Pixamon. I gotta record other things, anyways. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed uh, Pixamon today. Is she on the channel? Abstract channel announced connection exception. Connection timed out. No further information. Yeah. I guess I can't talk to these NPCs. I have to find the one that gives me the uh, blaze rod. That sucks. Uh, so, yeah, if you guys enjoyed this, leave a like. I say leave a dislike. Comment below anything you want to tell me or Monster Puppy. This is a great adventure. We're going to live stream this game when we... Once the video goes out, I guess. So once stay you tuned. Fix the issue. Well, not fix the issue. It's more like I have to once I get into the world quickly, like look away, and get away. So from you them. can't get near the villagers. No, I can't yeah. talk to them. Okay. So yeah, I guess other than that, I'll see you in the next video, or possibly live stream. Bye, guys. Good.